The life of a modern person is invariably connected with technology. Every day dozens of new gadgets are invented with the purpose of simplifying our lives. But we don't ever even begin to think that some of these impressive innovations were directly inspired by familiar animals. For example, one of these animal-inspired inventions were cats. In the old days, these animals were considered the companions of witches, and for good reason. Their most distinctive feature are their glowing eyes. Of course, we know now that a cat's eyes simply reflect light. It was this fact precisely why in 1935 that that drew the attention of a Nottingham road worker named Piercy Shaw to develop road signs that could be seen in the dark. Providing lighting for every alley would and is a very expensive endeavor. Still, drivers should be able to see road signs in the dark. In 1935, Piercy Shaw received a patent for cat's eyes, road reflectors. The first reflectors were marble bars contained in a rubber frame. In 1947, the aforementioned cat's eyes appeared on the roads, and their inventor was awarded the Order of the British Empire. In 1964, the first ever bullet train was built by the Japanese. It could reach speeds of up to 120 miles per hour, but this caused an annoying side effect. Every time the train came out of a tunnel, there was a loud and bothersome noise, and passengers complained of experiencing this unpleasant sensation while riding. An engineer and amateur ornithologist named Eiji Nakatsu found the problem. He discovered that the train, as it entered the tunnel, compressed air in that narrow space and thus produced a sonic boom. The solution to the problem was suggested by observations of a colorful diving bird called the kingfisher. The engineer noticed that this bird, when fishing, flew into the water making a relatively minuscule splash, and suggested that the nose of the locomotive should be shaped like a kingfisher's beak. Experiments conducted in a wind tunnel confirmed his idea, and Japanese trains became not only quieter, but also increased in speed by 10%, and reduced energy consumption by 15. Currently, Japan's high-speed trains have long beak noses like that of a kingfisher that help them exit tunnels safely and quietly. We have all heard of a particular kind of insect that glows magically in the dark, fireflies. These insects use light-generating organs to exchange signals with individuals of the opposite sex. A group of Korean physicists from the Institute of Advanced Science and Technology in Daejeon analyzed the structure of the abdomen of Japanese fireflies and tried to create an artificial analog of the glowing lantern of these insects. This invention was a prototype based on the lightning bug, which allowed them to make cheap lenses for powerful LEDs that can be used for lighting lamps with liquid crystal monitors helping in creating camera flashes on mobile phones, as well as a lighting source used in homes, cars, and medical devices. One class of living organisms remains a favorite among bionics specialists. That's insects. Out of all invertebrates, these strange-looking creatures are considered by many to be the perfect beings, Various types of insects have developed many highly effective survival mechanisms. One in particular is their vision. The study of a fly's faceted eyes has shown us that this insect is able to very accurately determine the speed of other objects and organisms moving at breakneck speeds. The many images of the moving object it sees are consistently perceived by each of its facets, and information about it is transmitted to individual receptors. This results in a series of independent images. Engineers copied the way a fly's eyes work to create detectors that quickly determine the speed of flying aircraft. This device is called the fly's eye. At times, it's useful and very peaceful to have almost total silence. For that very reason, it's convenient that we have soundproof rooms. Well, believe it or not, we should thank the owls for that. Although, owls use their muted feature for less peaceful purposes. Owls must be completely silent in order to reach their prey without hindrance. 
With that, they are helped by the way their feathered wings are designed to flap. There are fibers and tiny splits that isolate the airflow from their wings, which prevent any loud sounds to be emitted from them, including the flapping of feathers. The only sound left heard is that of its victim's final peep. The ability of an elephant's trunk to stretch out in any direction and grab anything it wants is really amazing. This is what inspired the German company, Festo, to develop a robotic arm that resembles the trunk of an elephant. A device called the Bionic Handling Assistant makes it easy to pick up items and move them around to other locations. Currently, robots are used in production that pose a danger to humans, preventing people from accidentally getting injured. The new robotic arm will not harm a person though, Festo assures. Sharks don't have a very good reputation among people, thanks in part to Hollywood masterpieces like Jaws. Granted, we know that according to statistics, more people are killed a year by cows than by sharks. Nevertheless, the sight of razor sharp teeth should make you feel uneasy. If you still want to pet a shark, be extremely careful. Although perfectly smooth at first glance, a shark's skin consists of sharp, jagged scales. If you rub a shark the wrong way, you can seriously injure yourself. Because of the way it's structured, the skin on a shark does not nurture parasites. So, following the shark's example, outer plates for ships are designed in the same fashion as a shark's skin. That way, debris and things won't stick to them. Also, it's common to see clothes made with a texture similar to shark skin for swimmers. Here's another one. Scientists have come up with an adhesive film covered with what resembles shark scales. It is used to cover surfaces in hospitals where harmful microbes can accumulate, tables, bedsides, and door handles. Sometimes the inspirers of big engineering solutions are totally tiny creatures. This particularly applies to Mark Brunnell's discovery. He once watched a shipworm making its way through an oak splinter. The worm's head was covered with a hard shell and jagged edges, with which it bore into trees. This prompted the scientist to design a tunneling shield, which was later used to dig a tunnel under the Thames. Modern drilling machines are an enlarged mechanical version of earthworms. Continuously moving forward, the worms eat through the earth and pass it through themselves, leaving behind a large tunnel. Drilling rigs operate on the same principle. Geckos are small tropical lizards that are interesting to watch. They can effortlessly run on walls and ceilings because of the fact that their legs are covered with millions of microscopic hairs. After the mystery of Gecko's amazing ability to attach itself to surfaces was solved, scientists created a super effective glue following that very principle. Even a small amount of this glue is enough to hold something that weighs more than 600 pounds to a flat surface. This glue does not leave spots. It is easy to remove, thus allowing you to remove the glued object no problem. Most animals have the ability to communicate with each other in a way that is unique to their species. Whales and dolphins are no exception. In fact, they have a really amazing ability to communicate with each other by means of hydrolocation. Thanks to this, they navigate underwater and can locate objects from a distance of 15 meters. Also, this helps them search for food and their friends. For this reason, scientists and inventors could not miss the chance to implement this into modern technology. Submarines, ships, and other naval vessels are equipped with the same sonar systems for navigation, tracking targets and preventing collisions with obstacles. Sound waves bounce off solid objects and return to the sonar gear, which reports information about the surrounding objects. Snakes are amazing creatures. We know a lot about their dangerous fangs and poison, but we don't know much about their other abilities. So why are snakes so dangerous both during the day and night? It's because the tricky Vermigrades are equipped with an amazing attribute, 
a kind of device that sees thermal infrared rays. The two holes in their head give them amazing vision. By improving the accuracy of the so-called snake method, scientists have created a unique thermal imaging diagnostic tool that allows them to see into the bowels of the earth. They also use it to create night vision goggles and other medical devices. Our planet is huge and full of curiosity. Who knows what other mysterious talents its inhabitants hold and we take for granted. If you know of any other cool attributes animals have, be sure to write about it in the comments below and share this video with your friends. Thanks for watching and see you next time.